So Kakadosh, Parashat Chayi Sara, the beginning, this is the Ben Yishchai. Ptiha. Achotenu atayil al perevavah. Our sister, you are going to be for multitudes of thousands. Minele b'siyata dishmeya, says the Ben Yishchai. It appears to me in the b'siyata dishmeya, tiyadua sheyesh arba olamot. There are four worlds. Okay, shehem, these are the four worlds. Atzilut beriyah yitziriyah asira. Okay? We know that actually our tefillah is based upon that. Our tefillah starts in Olam Asiya, goes up to Yetzirah, goes up to Beriyah, and then goes up to Atzilut. Atzilut is Amida. Okay? And then after the Amida, we go down. Every single time we say Kaddish, we bring it up a level. Every single time we say Kaddish afterwards, we bring it down a level. That's the way that tefillah is based upon. Okay? I don't know if you ever paid attention to that. You see it at the beginning of the some of the Mahzorim, they actually have... That's what happens at the beginning of Shachrit. It says here, the Ishmael Seach brings down also in Avodot Hashem and other places. From the beginning of Shachrit until Baruch Shamar, you're in Olam Ha'asiya, of working, of doing. From Baruch Shamar until you've said all, you're in your Olam Ha'yitzira. Okay, after, right, by the, after the Kaddish, remember, every time you're doing the Kaddish, you're changing. So after Yishtabach, yeah. From the Yotzer Or, we go f- until Gal Yisrael, it's Olam Abriya. <laughs> Sorry. And then by Gal Yisrael, when we start Amida, it's Olam Atzilut. Olam Atzilut. Okay. Afterwards, after the Amida, right, we go downwards. Okay. So basically what happens is that we go downwards. So the first step is from Kobanot until where? Until Baruch Shamar. Baruch Shamar until Yishtabach. After Yishtabach, Yotzer until Gal Yisrael. And Gal Yisrael is Amida, is the fourth. It's already all Yeah, four Olamot. From, from Korbano to Baruch Shamar, that's one. Baruch Shamar to Ishtabach, two. that's two. Ishtabach to Amida, that's three. Three, and the fourth one is Amida itself. Amida until, until the end. No, 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 then until the end of Amida. Then so we the go downwards. Amida. Then we go downwards, right? No, there's four Olamot. There's four Olamot. See, Ashre as Olama Bria. You're already going downwards. Okay, Ashre until Tefila Ledavid. Tefila Ledavid until Kaveh Yitzira. Right? And then when you finish... There, because it says until at Kaveh. When you get to the Kaveh, Kaveh until Alel and Shabbat, Asiya. Okay? And then you finish. So it's four going up and four going down. You go up one more time. You have the four worlds. And by the way, you should know that's why it says that the Hasidim and Ishunim used to wait an hour before the Tfilah and an hour after the Tfilah. Why an hour before the Tfilah and an hour after the Tfilah? Right? Because basically what happens is, is that. Yeah, what happens is, is that all of a sudden you have it going up, right? We're going up and then we're going down. Kaha. We just said that Hasidim and Nishunim, they used to pray one hour before Shachrit, one hour after Shachrit. Why? Because they have to go up the Olamo and then down the Olamo. Now he's going to explain something different. Now he says like this. You should know that the Arba Madregot are the same as four. What do I mean? There's four unities, units. Achadim, the units of ones. Asarot, of tens. Right? Me'ot, units of hundreds, and units of thousands. So therefore, achadim, units of ones, is olam asiya. Tens is olam yitzira. Me'ot, hundreds, is olam abriya. And thousands, olam atzilut. The adua, we know, the atzilut, there's no bad. Because it says in the pasuk, lo yigurecha ra. So ve'katub gam ken, be'etz ha'chaim, right, as the Kabbalah, v'chaim vitala, l'atzilut emar, ani Hashem u'shemi, u'chvedi le'acher lo eten. So that's why we say, Achotenu, our sister, At, Davka, Hayila al What is At? Shetinaki gamme in Atzilut. You're going to take from the Atzilut. Shehu sod alafim, because it's the thousands. The gamme mechinot, Revava, Shehu lemala yoter, which is even more, which that's sod a kete. Ve nirmeza be kotso shel yud, and that's the kots of the yod, the top part of the yod. Yan de ami sitra de kdusha, because you're part of sitra de kdusha. It's going to be from the Tumah. You cannot take from the thousands. And of course, you can't take from the ten thousands. It says, Okay, we're in the introduction. Okay, okay. 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 The, the Goim, they're going to see the Tfilin Shabbat Rosh, and they're going to be afraid. Because it's so that silut. The Allah it man that it's written uchodil lo yachel lo atem. Sheen magal eklipa sham. The klipot don't come to the tefillin shalosh. Belachem im nichaim yotem tefillin shalosh shaloshim. He said that's why they are going to become nichaim from the tefillin shalosh that a Jew puts on. 
and that's why the makom of the shalosh is makom se'ar shesham sof agulgolet shu ikar chelak arosh nigla. That's the main part of the head where a person is. So now we're going to start alacha alef. Ita b'midrash pliyah. It's brought down a midrash pliyah. En manichim tefillin ella b'shabbat. You only put on tefillin on Shabbat. You only put on tefillin on Shabbat. So he says, "Do pele." How does it mean? How, how do you understand those words? You only put on tefillin on Shabbat. When do we put on tefillin? Barav ma'asham pirish pezeh b'liyukat b'liyukatesh shusharim shelo shemesov sefer kanai miyansham. Ach shamati b'shem agonu b'kiv egezal. But you heard the name of b'kiv egezal shepirish maze b'shabbat. Where do you put the tefillin, Shabarosh? It cannot be on the forehead. Where do you put the tefillin, Shaliyad? Not at the beginning of the arm. When you make the muscle. It's called here, Tavukom Tafuach. Okay? Ki tefillin, Shabarosh, Tino l'anichom b'mkom se'ar. Tefillin, Shaliyad, Tzarich l'anichom b'rech t'ichton ha'samuch l'katef. Bebasar ha'gavua v'tafuach ha'nika kiboret. On the muscle, on the, on the right? לשון קיבורת דהיני, פירושו קבוצת התמנים. וכן רוצים לומר, כן, זה הקבוצת התמנים, וכן אני רוצה לומר קבוצת הבשר, והיינו בשר התפוח. So that's the בשר התופח, which is right here, when you make the muscle. Meaning if you put it lower down, right, where the muscle is, you know, it has to be up here. Once you make the muscle and it goes up, that's where it starts. Plus, on the head, במקום בשר. So therefore, במקום שיער. So that's what it means. בשבת, במקום שיער, במקום תפוח, בית שין, בית תף. Where do you put תפלין? Only on שבת. Okay, you don't put it on the way, you don't put it on That's what it means, I'll write on, putting on תפלין. כן. Continue. So he says, right like this, he says, על כן צריך להזהיר את העם בזה. So we have to try to warn all the people. בפרט בתפלין שלוש, especially by תפלין שלוש. But there's a lot of people that are נכשלים והם דתיים יותר, which means a lot of people come. They put on the תפלין right here. And it's on their forehead, but it's not in Kom Se'ad. It has to be in Kom Se'ad. So the bottom part of the Titura, the Titura is a box. So the bottom part of that box has to be still where there's Ikare Se'ad. Shegama Titura, because the Titura itself is a Tfilin, meaning not only the top box is a Tfilin, even the bottom box, which is longer, that's also part of the Tfilin. Some people, they have long hair. It's called a chuk. Yeah? And what happens? He yeah, says, afterwards. <laughs> yeah, and then what happens is, is that it goes all the way down here. So he says, even though that person now is going to put it on the se'ad, he's going to put it right here. He says, lo mehani, doesn't help. You need where the roots are. Not from the, meaning if I'm going to leave my hair long and I'm going to put all my hair down, no, yeah, and I'm school. going to put it right here. So here there's hair. Yeah, but it's not the roots. The roots is here. So therefore, all the way, if I guess, especially I'm going to bring a long chubanga, all the way down, like it. I'm putting it here. No, 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 no. It's not ikare se'ari. Ikare se'ari is the roots. But Rabbi, there are people the that have it below the titura, even growing below the titura. Okay, so if they have it, they have it, but it has to be ikar, ikar se'ari. Okay, but the main thing is that ikare se'ari is not. The shiur makom ze'u ad shemuchot shel tinok rofes. So until where does it go backwards? So backwards it goes until where the child's head you know, when a baby is born, it's very, very soft. So if you put your fingers right here, it's very, very soft. So you put it lower. So that's a karein. That means a karein, they put it over here on the forehead. He also gets punished. Okay? Umihu, however, though, you have some old people that their hair falls out. Or a bald person. They don't have hair. He puts it where he used to have hair. And now you can actually see it with your eyes. There's a difference between the skin, where it's that a person was bald, and a person that it doesn't grow by anyone. That means even a person that's bald, you still could know where was his hair. hairline. But, right? Yeah, the hairline. We have it here, right? In the Sefer Katan there. Right? That means basically the Chaya Adam says, even if you have the majority of the tefillin in a proper place, but even if you have a little tiny pit on the wrong place, you need the entire thing. 
שווי דברי החיי אדם נזכר, אלא כן, אני עושה פס כנראה. גם זכרתי שם שכתב בסייעתא דשמיא בסביבתו רב ברכות, ירקו באיזה מדינה פרשיות היוצאות חוץ הבית, ופלפלתי דברים אלו, וסוף דבר ללכת בצורת החיי אדם, דבר עניין כל הבית כולו מפרשה. So it comes out that not even the majority, all, meaning you could have a person that he has his tefillin here, the majority of the tefillin are the proper place, but you have a little tiny bit, a little bit, down, what it says the whole. Wallow, why? Also, the man of you says a lot. No, no, I don't know. Yeah, that's a bit there. Okay, Alakha Bet, Gam, a Kesher Shel Rosh Yeh Munach Bemkom Seah. Also, the Kesher of the Rosh Yeh Munach Seah. Begob Ha'orif and the Neep, Shu Sof Etzem Agugo, which is the end of the, the back part of the neck, right? Lu Kenega Da Panim, which is opposite of the face. Vi Meniach Kesher Al Tzavar, let's say you put it on, on, the, on the neck. Lu Asa Klum, Shen Zinkar, it's not called Orif. Orif is the Neep, so that's to be here. Has to be at the end of the gulgola. Here's the gulgola, the skull, the end. Okay, fine. Gimel. Tzarich lechaven atfilin shel rosh shetea ketitza beemsa roch avarosh. So now we spoke about the top part and the lower, and the meaning the top and the lower, and in the back, top and lower, and on the arm. What about from side to side? Because I only gave you the dimensions from here to here, here to here, and here. What about left to right? So it says, "Sirich lechaven atfilin shel rosh shetea ketitza beemsa roch." So it's in the middle. So it should be between the eyes. So also the back part should be in the middle. It shouldn't be one, one, one direction or the other. Also the part where it looks like a dalet, right? Also the part where it looks like a dalet, also the part where it looks like a dalet, right? Yelet tzad chutz should be looking on the outside. Lo kapeh ahoret. Meaning that the dalet part should be on the outside, not backwards, to the inside. The word in the kasher should be in the yod, the same thing with the yod. He says, actually, it's a pech. He should be careful that the yod should not turn around. In the pech, now it does turn around, נכון להתענות, יש פסט. אם קשה עליו התענית, יבדו בצדקה נפשי. It's too good to fast, יב צדקה. So here it says, וכתב הרב המחבר בספרו עוד יוסף חי, שיש מי שכתב, זה לא מחויב תענית, אלא דווקא עם פשע. Some people say you only have to fast if you did it פשיעה, negligent, not by accident. Right, which means you, you just, uh, you know, you left it like that. But if not, then you don't need to do it. Okay? וכתב הרב שאם הוא בן תורה, שהתענית תפריע לו בלמידו, וזה פרסון זה בן תורה, זה הליכות עולם, ברינג זאון, זה ילקוד יוסף. אם זה פרסון זה לרנין, או אם זה קובע את יתינו תורה, אתה יכול לעשות את זה לתחילה, רדימה וצדקה. אז עוד פעם, זה הליכות עולם, 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 זה הליכות In the Od Yosef Chai, which is also the Ben Yishchai, but the newer version, like it's a new version also, but he only wrote on, on not on the, he didn't finish the entire book, but he only wrote on certain things. So there, in Parashah Vayera, he says, some people say you're not obligated to do Ta'anit unless you were Bish, the Pshia. Pshia means, Nita Tzalta. You will become Atzlan. You will become an Atzlan. No, 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 you have to do it properly. So he says over here, Ve'ketav Arav, She'im hu ben Torah. So Yoku Yosef brings down that if he's a ben Torah and it's going to bother his learning, or he's Kovea Itim la Torah, and it's going to stop him from learning Torah, redeem it with tzedakah, that's it. Don't pass. Redeem it with tzedakah. So if it comes out that the person's, you know, whether it's a yod turned around, this turned around, whatever it was, redeem it with tzedakah, that's it. Halakha dalet. Abatim ha retzuot tefilin shel rosh ha tefilin tiyad shel shu shkhrot. Halakha lo moshem yisinai. Meaning, halakha lo moshem yisinai means that the black on the straps and on the batim, they should be, halakha lo moshem yisinai, black. Velachen im labdu bechrat yashnam. What happens if it became whitened because it was too old? To make it black again. And if a goy made it black, you have to make it yourself. Now the black part has to be on the outside. If it turned around, again, do a fast. So again, we go back to the same halacha. Okay? You know that Rav Huna fasted 40 days because of this. But he says it's midat chasidut. You don't really need to fast for 40 days. וטוב להיזהר גם בצורות תפילין של ראש, also you should be careful with תפילין של ראש, right? שמשושלת על החזר טבור, and also the תפילין של יד, that you put on your, on your arm also, that it shouldn't become backwards, meaning it's much more easier for these parts to turn around. But there you don't have to do, there you don't have to do תענית. When you talk about the תענית, was the one around the head, okay? And then there he's saying that you don't have to, okay? Well, he said, you should redeem him for tzedakah, that's what he said before. אוקיי? וכן לצורה של תפילין של יד שקורא כפיים, ואף אגב דעל פי הסוד משקיעים לצורה פנים ואחור, שחורות קאורת, זה דיונות על הקורנטות קבלה, you're supposed to make it black on both sides. 
I did, and it make all of my tzitzit talit black and my white shirt black. And everything so don't is black. don't don't uh, you have to buy it. You I cannot bought it buy it that way. Of course, you buy it. No, they die for you, Rabbi. Yeah, but they do it. It's already done. For yeah. You. So therefore, so it's not going to go. It. It's not going to go on your on your clothes. לא נאגדו ושאלתי מנהג חסידים מיד הקודש שתי ודמי ומדמיניהם ואמר לי שיש לי זנין נשכי פנים ואחור ויש שם דפיקים וזה אז some people are careful in it and some people are not careful in it